city of Detroit is closing to closer rather to completing a new state of the art animal care shelter on the east side. The facility will care for almost twice the capacity of the current shelter on Chrysler Drive. CBS News Detroit's Andres Gutierrez joins us from the shelter after touring its future home. Go, Today, Princess is heading to her new home. Yeah. However, for every yeah. princess, there are dozens of others at Detroit's Animal Care and Control Center waiting. In some cases, time runs out. As the shelter grapples with overcrowding, their euthanasia rates are 8% higher than before the pandemic, meaning this year around 2,000 animals will never make it to their forever home. But down the road, work is underway at the new shelter that will double their capacity. When you first come in, it's wide open, clear, um, inviting. Uh, we'll have a new reception desk here to the left where people will introduce you. Uh, we also add a couple of rooms where you could meet um, and play with your dog. The framing is up in what used to be part of a 15 acre waste facility. Soon they'll be installing more than 200 kennels. So here um, down the row, is the clinic area in this corner. So that will be a new clinic office. Uh, we have a prep room, surgeon room as well. The amenities are set to provide better care for the animals brought in. That was one thing the staff really wanted um, is a enclosed area where they could pull in their trucks and be able to maneuver the dogs while taking them out of the trucks. Currently, the space in their garage does not, um, is not big enough to be able to do that, so they have to do it outside, and which could be a challenge sometimes. At $6 million, repurposing the existing building at Ferry and Russell and expanding it is saving the city money, considering the rise in construction costs. And we were working um, hand in hand with the state um, to ensure that we were preparing um, a property or a location that would suit not only our, our, our animal control needs, but also be compliant with the state regulations um, as it pertains to um, animal control. And so when the new facility does open and all the animals are safely moved over, the plans are that this building will be demolished. The new 30,000 square foot facility is set to open by the end of this year. In Detroit, Anders Gutierrez, CBS News, Detroit.